when I first moved here, I got into snowboard uh, alpine racing, giant slalom, slalom, and super G. And uh, that was one of the big things at the time. So I jumped right in both feet and within probably two years was uh, a very high level athlete in Summit County. I've been dropping cliffs and riding steep terrain since I moved to Breckenridge in the late 80s and um, coached for several years after that and um, began to really understand how to take athletes to a new level. Breckenridge is a great draw for Olympians. We have a lot of training facility here with half pipe and slope style. Our freeway park is probably one of the top in the country. Our half pipe is one of the longest in the country. This facility for freestyle and alpine training in Breckenridge has been um, outstanding. Starting to create a lot more of a buzz with uh, athletes coming and moving here. A lot of times in the freestyle realm, they, uh, athletes are looking for a well-groomed park, a well-groomed pipe, something that's going to be high standard so no matter where the competition is, they will be able to go and transfer that knowledge, that experience to the new terrain of whatever resort they're going to compete at. They're looking for an overall program. Um, they need uh, the actual area to train, freestyle, parks and pipes, uh, gates and courses, but they also need a facility to cross train. We have um, world class uh, events like uh, snowshoeing, cross country skiing, which allow them to cross train and stay in shape more for a all around athlete. The snow that we get at Breck is so light and so fluffy that it's one of those things that enables us to ski those steeps jump those rocks, you know, launch those cliffs. And that probably is what tempted me to stay here for such a long period of time. We can teach anything from beginner to expert level and anything in between.